Hey everybody, it's Mickey and in today's video we are going to organize under our kitchen sinks. So when it comes to organizing the cabinet under your kitchen sink, the problem is having too much stuff crammed into a small space and not being able to find the thing you need. If this is your first time here, I'm so glad that you found me. I hope you will take a minute and subscribe. I post new videos every week about all things home. I have really been working on simplifying my home and routines and I think one of the most important ways that you can do this is by simply having less stuff. As you can see, I have very little usable space under my sink. This is where we house the trash can and this is where I also need to store dish soap, trash bags, and a few cleaning supplies. So much space is taken up with the pipes and the garbage disposal that I had to get a little creative to utilize the space that I have. So the first thing that I did was to lay some peel and stick tile on the floor of my cabinet. This helps protect the cabinet from water and detergent spills and it also makes it so much easier to clean up. Peel and stick tiles are very inexpensive and you can find them at Home Depot or any home improvement store. Since this was the space that we had to store our trash can, I wanted it to be easy to pull in and out. I found this roll out bin holder on Amazon that I will leave a link to down below. It was very easy to install and we have used it for the last couple years and has held up great even with constant use. To utilize the space on the other side of the cabinet, I found the shelf riser on Amazon that I will also leave a link to down below. By using this shelf riser, I easily doubled the space I had left for storage. Since space is very limited, I really had to decide what was absolutely necessary to be stored under the sink. I was using these Dollar Tree dish pans to hold my supplies and help work as a drawer under the riser. In this first bin, I only have my trash bags, some extra dishwasher detergent, an extra sponge, and a plug for my sink. I use this storage system a lot in my cabinets because it's so simple, inexpensive, and doubles my space. In these small lidded containers from Walmart, I keep my Brillo pads and my Mr. Clean Magic erasers. I always cut these in half because I never use a whole piece for any cleaning job and cutting them in half makes them easier to store and more economical. I have paired my cleaners stored under the seat down to just my Wyman stainless steel polish, my Method Granite and All Purpose Cleaner, and also my Costco Mambo Size Cascade. Letting go of those extraneous things that we sometimes hold on to can really create a neater, more utilized, and organized space. The cleaners and supplies that I have stored under my kitchen sink are those things that I use on a daily basis. And although space is limited, I do have a few open spots should I need to add anything else to my supplies. So thank you so much for watching today. If you enjoyed this quick organizing project, let me know in the comments section down below and I will be sure to add more of them into my video schedule. Don't forget to subscribe and until I see you in that next video, I hope that you love the life that you have and I will see you again soon. Bye!